Welcome back gamers to your favorite cooking show, The Gamer Kitchen. In the last episode I showed you how to cook a nice gamer crepe. But since this lies in the past, now let's make something new. What's this new thing you're asking about? Well, it's nothing less than a very nice tasting cheese soup. This recipe I'm gonna show you is enough for about two people. But first things first, let's discuss the ingredients. First off, we're gonna take 100 grams of Gouda. The next thing we need for our cheese soup is Gorgonzola. About 60 grams should be enough. If you take more, then prepare your soup to get a little bit more salty. But of course, salt is nothing new for gamers, so do as you like. The last cheese of our three cheeses is the Parmigiano. We're gonna grate it later, so that's the reason why we don't need any unit. The next thing is parsley leek, ham cubes, an onion, two spoons of vegetable broth, 100 milliliters of milk and 400 milliliters of water. Okay, and the last ingredient we're gonna need is just a simple cat. Wait, no, that's wrong, I'm not Chinese. Well, moving on. Now you just have to put the water inside of your cooking pot and let the water boil. But as soon as the water actually boils, turn down the heat to a low setting. Now it's time for a little knife action. First take your parsley and slap it. This will make the oils and the flavors come out. Take your leek and remove the white part. And here's a little life hack from me. You can put the white part inside a water bowl and make the whole plant regrow for about two to three times. You can even leave it in the fridge. Now just chop up your leek. Chop, chop, chop. And done. Okay, now let's move on to the onion. You'll want to dice it into small cubes. Also for this recipe, I would prefer a white onion over a red one because it goes better with the cheese. The time has come to throw our ingredients inside the pot. Start off with the Gouda, next the Gorgonzola, now the parsley, followed up by the leek and the white onion. Pour in your milk and finish it off with the two teaspoons of vegetable broth. Okay, now we have everything inside that we need. However, there are two more ingredients we haven't used yet. One of which are the ham cubes. Take a pan with some vegetable oil in it and throw the cubes inside. Now cook it on medium heat. Once they're ready, remove the vegetable oil from the cubes. Now that the ham cubes are ready too, we can throw them in. All we have left to do now is to stir our soup. Stir it until the cheese is fully melted. Alright, now change the heat setting to low and wait for about 3 minutes. I don't know about you, but that's enough time to get some gaming in. Today my game of choice will be Dark Souls 3. What will you play while you're waiting? Let me know in the comments.
Now let's get back to cooking. I was a bit faster than 3 minutes. Well, no need to worry, my soup is already ready. Now it's time to grab a plate and a bowl to put our soup inside. With a little help from a ladle, we can get our soup outside of the pot and inside our bowl. Mmm, this smells already very nice. And now I'm going to show you what we needed the parmigiano for. We need it to be our cherry on top. And just like that, we've used all of our ingredients and made a very nice tasting cheese soup. Alright, now that was my recipe for my cheese soup. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. And as always, leave a like and subscribe and maybe tell me in the comments how you liked the video.